it's so good to see you again. Uh, thank you so much for joining us. I know things are a little different this year, but thank you so much for being part of hashtag DevNet Day. You go way back with DevNet. You've got the t-shirt to prove it. 2014, I don't know if that was the first Cisco DevNet Day. I think someone had black t-shirts. So I was very excited when you have cheerful t-shirts on another day. That was the when first was DevNet the first in San Francisco. Yeah, for sure. Oh, perfect. All right. So. I've been kind of lurking around DevNet for years, and um, this year I've actually decided to go ahead and finish and get a certification, maybe because they've come out. So I signed up for the DevNet Associate course, and I've been working through it. And I finished the course, and I was going to take the exam um, soon, but then I kind of haven't studied for a while, so I have to study again. A, a lot of people are, you know, giving it a try now online. So I don't know how long we'll be, you know, staying home, but that's it's great to have that online option now. But um, you know. What other people in the community do you keep in touch with and how do you help each other? A lot through, through teams. And so on uh, Cisco Champions Teams, we have various spaces you can chat. And in my company, we use Teams too to chat on projects or whatever. So a lot of it is um, how are people doing, but also specific problems like, hey, I'm trying to solve this. Has anyone run into this before? And then get a hint. And, and what's been your experience as a Cisco Champion? Because, you know, that's a pretty cool group to be part of. It has a great mix of people from all over the place, and it's interesting to hear their experiences. Um, uh, I, I, I enjoy learning what other folks are working on and every now being able to, now and then being able to contribute a bit. I got to ask you a question. What does community mean to you? Um, community is sort of an opportunity for others to, or for you and others to in, uh, interact. And so whether it's uh, digitally or personally or whatever, it's how do you find out what's going on? How do you keep in touch? And how do you share ideas? Sharing ideas and, and being there for each other. And thank you so much for being here with us today. And thank you for wearing that shirt. I was not at the first DevNet Zone in San Francisco 2014, but I see you were, so I really appreciate you sharing that with us. Thank you. All right, well, thank you.